Alright, hello and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IV. This is Veteran 0121. Yeah, and this cave kind of sucks right now because I'm getting lags, so... Oh well. Oh yeah, maybe I should actually cast a uh, float here. Might be a good idea. Well, it's not too bad, I guess. As long as there's no lag in la random battles, then it doesn't really matter, in my opinion. Alright. Alright, we got her. Come on, Cecil. Okay. Oh. Yep, secret passage. this chest here we get an elven bow uh, third best bow in the game there's actually two bows that are better than it but I won't be using bows anyway so that doesn't really matter yeah those things are chumps <laughs> oh Cool, we got a Gaia drum for free from that thing. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure exactly uh, how rare it is in their drop list, but uh, yeah, awesome. Free Quake spell. It's, it's kind of redundant now that I don't have Tella anymore since he doesn't learn the Quake spell and I already have Quake with Rydia, but eh, whatever. Alright, a thousand gil. And we get a cottage. Hope the land of the Idolans isn't slow like this place. Yeah, these guys are these guys are putsy cats as long as they aren't casting uh like bad breath and bile and all that garbage. Can handle their physical attacks. Okay. Yeah, I think this cave is just a little bit too much for the emulator to handle. Ah, you bastard. Right off the bat, they're gonna make it annoying as hell. <laughs> I 
Yeah. Trying to slow these guys down a little bit. This takes him out. All right, we got him. All right, we get a spider so for beating him. Awesome. Silver apple. All right. Alright, we get a summon drop there. Golden Apple. Golden Apples actually uh, permanently increase HP by 100 as opposed to 50 that the Silver Apples have, so... Okay. Well, that's all the treasure in this little area for now. Yeah, I don't mind them physically attacking Cecil. Get a remedy. Yeah, that's, that's the really annoying thing about this place, having to uh, <coughs> cast float over and over again when you go to a different floor, so. And the random encounter in here is pretty bad, too. Okay, we got a new enemy here, Evil Dreamer. They are, I don't know what they're weak to, weak to. they're just irritating, extremely irritating. Because they like to cast status effects over and over and over again. Yeah, and the uh, evil dreamers absorb fire. Try silent verse on these guys, see what happens. Of course, why not? Well, I got one of them at least. Yeah, they get quite a bit of HP. I think they got around like 5,000 or something. So, yeah, they're pretty annoying.
Alright, well, we can go down that way, but... Whoa-ho! Secret passage. Yep. And this chest... We get a Mage Masher. Alright, we got a Bog Witch here. We want to kill very quickly. Alright, we got her. That's a good opportunity right here to just uh, use Prey a few times while I'm killing these Toads. That way uh, I can keep my MP high. Don't have to worry about using a save point to replenish MP or ethers or any of that. Okay, we get the Mage Masher. It uh, uh, the two characters that can actually equip it are Rydia and Edge. Uh, it deals extra damage to mages. Um, yeah, it's got really good accuracy. Uh, other than that though, I don't really like it. Uh, the attack power isn't that great, and uh, you'd actually deal more damage anyways. Well, I suppose it's better than the Kunai, Kunai Blade. I'll equip it for now, I guess, but I'll be getting something better soon enough, so... And... what the hell? Okay, never mind. Okay, and whoop, yep, secret passage. Yeah, I'll try casting the dragon summon on him, why not? I don't think those evil dreamers are, uh, can absorb holy elemental, so we'll try it out, I guess. Hmm. Still only just one of them. Oh well. <laughs> 